The three muses, Cleo, Areto, and Euterpe, represent different aspects of creativity and inspiration in Greek mythology. Each muse is associated with a specific art form and is often depicted with objects or symbols that represent their respective domain. These muses were believed to inspire artists, musicians, and poets, guiding them in their creative endeavors. Cleo, the muse of history, is often depicted holding a scroll. She is responsible for inspiring historians and writers, guiding them in their efforts to record and preserve the events of the past. Cleo's influence is seen in the works of historians and chroniclers who seek to document and interpret the history of the world. Arito, the muse of lyric and love poetry, is often portrayed playing a lyre. She is associated with the art of poetry, particularly love poetry, and is said to inspire poets and writers to create beautiful and emotional verses. Arito's influence can be seen in the works of poets who celebrate love and romance, using their words to evoke passion and longing. Euterpe, the muse of music and flutes, is often depicted playing flutes. She is responsible for inspiring musicians and composers, guiding them in the creation of beautiful melodies and harmonies. Euterpe's influence can be seen in the works of musicians who seek to create music that uplifts and inspires, using their talents to evoke emotion and stir the soul. In addition to Cleo, Arito, and Euterpe, there are many other muses who represent various art forms and aspects of creativity. Melpomene, the muse of tragedy, is often depicted holding a tragic mask. She inspires playwrights and actors in the creation and performance of tragic dramas, guiding them in their exploration of sorrow and suffering. The muses played a significant role in ancient Greek culture, serving as a source of inspiration and guidance for artists and creators. They were believed to be the daughters of Zeus and Mnemosyne, the Tetanus of memory, and were often invoked by artists seeking inspiration for their work.